hear me. Let me pull this down here. Maybe you can hear me better. Sorry. So this is a basically how to help you with YouTube annotations. I do a lot of annotations and I've come up with ways as you can see here uh, to help you because basically all these colors are useless um, under uh, different background. To give you an example, let me just show you. So let's say I want this to show up, right? So if I just open up a speech bubble and put this on here, I want to show you the difference between the two. All right. All right. So here it is with just like, hey, just black. Right. You can't read it. Okay. I say, okay, I can't read it. So you go back and now you're going to go back and say, all right, let's um, make it a different color. Let's make, well, let's make it Oh, I'll try. Okay, let's try every one of these colors. Well, okay, how's that? Oh, still can't read it. Okay, let's go back. And, and if you go through, uh, if you go through every one of these colors, which I have, they're all useless. This is the only color, right? That's variable. However, which looks better? You tell me. This one, you can still see the shit before you can't read it. All right. So the hack here is the best obscurer is the speech bubble. So a way around the, um, the crap is to actually use a combo of the speech bubble with this. Now, actually, if I change this to different colors, okay, it actually works out pretty good. And if I actually go to black, the reason why is because the speech bubble is masking the background. Simple hack. Enjoy. Thanks.